There's nothing like it when a student all of a sudden realizes that they love something, they want to do something, they want to learn more about something specific, some skill. And then as the, as the skill develops, then they just get even more excited. Oftentimes, kids don't know that they can sing, that can act, they can create something on stage that perhaps they've never done before. You need blood and he's got more than enough! You need blood and he's got more than enough! They discover that wow I can really do this and that could be acting or singing or, or even tech or lights or sound some something that gets you excited something that that causes a student to be engaged in something they would never even thought of before but they want to do it and it could give them a chance to challenge themselves because that's what we look for we look for really good scripts and characters who can grow develop and something about the story that is transformative so we can see people going through experiences and coming out the other side for the good or for the bad or for the ugly, whatever, however it pans out. She said, my boy, I think someday you'll find a way to make it natural dentist pay. Hey, I'll be a dentist. Be a dentist. You have a talent for causing things pain. Hey. Son, be a dentist. Son, be a dentist. Pay you to be and that's, that's the thing that makes these plays uh, a notch above other plays or, or musicals. Feed me Seymour, feed me all night long. That's right, boy, you can do it. Feed me Seymour, feed me all night long. It's a partnership all the way through, and the partnership is very similar to a classroom. A teacher partners up with a student, and the student cannot just sit back and, and have the class given to them. The student has to lean forward and meet the teacher halfway, if not more. And it's the same thing in theater. You, you meet each other at a certain point where you work with each other back and forth. What we are after is presenting a possibility of an experience for this audience so that they can get excited and get thrilled and get shocked and cry and laugh and everything that human beings do and then go away uh, from this experience remembering it for a long, long time. But uh, it's, really, it's really terrific to end on a high note with Little Shop of Horrors because it's a crazy, wild, funny, insane story. What's better than that?